Hello there, and welcome back to some Crusader Kings 3. In the Bronze Age, we are playing as the Mai Keen. And I want to try and develop our realm a bit better. When we left off, did I get claims somewhere at all? No, I don't think I did. I think we were just uh, defeating someone. No, well, let's have a look at our council. I would like you to perhaps increase development in my home county instead. Try and get that a bit stronger. We can also have you increase control there instead of increasing levies. Every reinforcement rate, garrison size. That's actually a lot. Maybe we'll just leave you on there for now. Excellent. I would like some more high trained troops. Even just some light firstmen. We lack much money though. So we, what we're going to do is we're going to speed ahead. And we are going to buy some light footmen as soon as we can afford them. We don't need uh, too much in terms of... Uh, let's go for an educator on our daughter. We'll give it to our wife. We don't need too much in terms of numbers. What I want is quality here, and we will not allow them a uh, tax lien. And what we're going to do is we're going to go and slaughter these few peasants. There's not terribly many of them. They shouldn't be too hard to destroy. Excellent. That was very, very easy. Let's go ahead and uh, enforce the there against this man. This man here can fight. He's very good at it. So we're going to go ahead and negotiate his release for recruitment and a weak hook. So be it, unless of course disband our army. We can also take a new focus here. So we'll go with uh, Five Secret Speed Murder Scheme Power. Yeah, sure, in case we do need to kill somebody off. Somebody over here, perhaps, if we were to try and inherit it through our son. That would be very, very useful, but not the uh, most important thing in the world at the moment. Watch your step, my good man. Money does go up relatively well, but it could go up even better. I also am concerned about my income. I would like to have some monetary buildings around here. There's a fair few to choose from, and of course these guys do have more unique buildings. You've got royal palaces, walls of making, there's many things to do. But for now I want to get the troops first. A passing suspicion. It is well known facts that courtiers will scheme and plot. But I'm able to turn this to my advantage if we have them suspicious of each other. This one again. Let's go ahead with the... Uh, yeah, let's place spies among them instead. We'll just uh, keep up with how it is there. Excellent. We have gained this island here because one of my friends is going over and de war for it. So we are a little bit stronger. But I think it, it goes through very weakly. So them having 136 levies, that might only give me an extra 10 or something by the time we get the forces through him. It doesn't go up much at all. What we can do now, though, is creation of a man's arms regiment. We'll be getting light footmen. 100 of them. They won't be too much in terms of money, but it is a lot of extra soldiers, and that is ultimately what we want here. Hopefully they do well. Extra development here is going to give us some more stuff, so I'm happy about that. Money is going up fast, though, so what I might do now is try to start fabricating again, or we could go on a raid war. However, lots of people here are strong. So, oh wait, are your allies actually your guys underneath you? No, this guy is not. He's over here and he is relatively strong, so fighting you both would be quite a pain in the ass. I am stronger than you both. Individually, not together. Greetings, my sensible liege. I have been hosting your Chancellor for several weeks and he has helped me truly see your splendour of the realm. And your He's helped me truly see the splendour of your realm. Under uh, your ruler. Uh, helped see the splendor of the realm. Uh, I, it's just me messing up words there. Just ignore that. And he is honored to serve as a vassal. Well, thank you very much. I am glad that you will do such a thing. Let me learn to inherit many titles. Well, I'm glad of that. I've gained 50 gold. Well, thank you, wife. Thank you very much. Now, we should, with that money, just start really seriously planning to attack somewhere. Not sure where. You, we no longer have a truce with, do we? No, we don't. So we could go after this man again. If I were to focus on his capital, they might give me the entire duchy. No, they won't give me a duchy because he doesn't have the duchy himself. Let's just try and push further down on his coast. I would like that. Excellent. We'll, uh, we'll just wait there for something to happen. Let's however move you down this way so we can jump straight onto his land and uh, deal with everything there. I designated Guardian for Achilles. He is now six years old. Let's go ahead and make it myself. Send a proposal. As my other son, though, I don't know whose guardian is, but I would like it to be me. Personal offer guardianship. Yes, myself. Let's go ahead with that. 
He will accept. Of course he'll accept. He's my son. He doesn't really get a choice in this, does he? His education focus is on intrigue. No, we don't want that. Only employer can choose to focus. Well, that's me, is it not? Am I not... Am I not the guy in charge here? I don't want you to have intrigue focus. And my son Achilles, I want you to have... A martial focus. Change the focus there. As my daughter, though, will... Intrigue really? No. Give her... Some stewardship focus. Excellent. But the boy here, really, why can I not change it? Is it because I made him a lord? Anyway, my wife is pregnant again, so we'll go ahead and have a look at that. We could always disinherit our son and heir. See it done! A claim has been made, and what we'll do is... We'll go ahead and fabricate another one. I'm not sure if I can press for multiple claims, though. So we're going to fabricate the claim somewhere else. Let's have a look. There is you all the way over here. 1,000 men and an ally of 250. That ally is, however, on your own. Course. Cool. So let's go and probably go for dime. Or we could go inland. It's to Gaia here. He has a couple of friends. The Handman and Pylos over there. Pylos is quite strong. Pylos is quite strong. Him, 500 odd. So together they have about 1,000 more men than me. And that's a shame because I do want to go into your land. I really do. Laconia here. You have a thousand men. You're allied to this guy with 600. Again, quite strong. You there. We could just go after your island because then it's only one place to siege down. That's what we're going to do. We're going to go and try and take this island. Islands are good. I like islands. A little experimentation. A long evening of state business with... Loagatus Axotas has slowly degenerated in both of us being deep in our cups. Slowing, slowingly swapping saucy stories. I've just finished my retelling of a tale relating the natural proclivities of certain barbaric cultures when I see an untold gleam in my companion's eye. Thoughts of black male race unbidden to my mind, perhaps. Loagatus is actually a little keener on a subject than he knows. Sure. He's lost opinion of me, but that's all well and good. Wait, what? My wife is dead. As I wait outside the birthing chamber, each minute feels like a lifetime. Andromeda's screams have ceased with no infant's cry to replace it. Something is wrong. I can feel it in my bones. The door opens. The midwife's wretched expression confirms all my fears. I am so sorry, my lord. Lady Andromeda, your son, they are both in death. We gain a lot of stress. That's a shame. We uh, we don't like stress. Not quite overwhelmed by stress, but stressed nonetheless. Another elevable perk here. Let's go with hostile scheme success plus 25%. We could try and get another marriage. I wouldn't be opposed to it. There is a alliance potential with Kudomi, the uh, island over part of Crete. We're already allied to Crete. Let's not worry about that. Here is you guys. You are all the way over here. And you guys down there, I'm not so interested in people in this island, no. You over there, you islanders. She's a bit older. This Sami there. 600 forces. Um, you? Where are you? Oh, this is the island we're fabricating. No, let's not go for that. You all the way up there. Can we just try and pick somebody more directly? Athens, perhaps. You do have a daughter who's five. Can I arrange a betrothal at all? Between me and her? Yes, I can. We will get an alliance with Athens, who will be very strong. I know I was looking at potentially uh, invading them earlier, but no, I'd rather have them as an ally. Actually, because then we can attack their ally. Where did their ally go? They're no longer allied to this guy. Ah, he's now only allied to you. I see. Um, of course, well, we do still have an ally there. Greetings, my sensible liege. I hereby invite you to a feast at my court in Angaria. It will be a grand affair worthy of your honourable presence. Okay, great. Every guest is gathered in the great hall, and our gracious host has welcomed us to his feast. But with that welcome, let's go ahead and declare this war here. It's been a bit of time. We've gained a bit more money now. We'll press our claims. Supposedly inferior... Oh, he has a lot of allies? He is allied to both you and you. You, I don't know where you are. Oh, is this the Islander? 
and Freda Cup. Can we? Excellent. Thank you. Please do go on. Let's. The Lord over there is smiling at a maid across the hall with intimate familiarity. A possible affair. That Lord on the other side of the hall is keeping to the walls, putting all conversation as well as eye contact. A secret to keep safe, perhaps. Everyone is hiding something, and with a practiced eye, even the smallest of details will show the whole picture. Well, great. Let's have a look at this guy's friends, because there are numerous people showing up. There's you. Oh, the island over here, I see. He's quite strong. But we'll immediately destroy your army. So I don't, I don't think we're going to be in any trouble here. Let's go ahead and declare this war. Let's raise our force, the entirety of it. Eight days, they believe, to raise them. And let's go over here. What a feast! I will remember the day spent in his halls for a long time to come. Now it is time to wash off the traces of merriment and wine, and once more resume my duties as Lord of the Realm. Farewell. I gain stress from going to the feast due to my shyness. Of course I do. They have quite a lot of forces here, but they believe the chances are even. We have more men at arms and... Better general? Yes. Okay, let's go and have a bit of a fight here, shall we? I'm sure we'll smash them with our chariots. Oh, they actually went over here. Well, they'll come in and attack us. Very good. We actually start with a negative advantage here. Let's hope that this doesn't remain so negative. No, we're actually losing more people than we're killing. Right, in that case then, you are going to be called to my aid here. Come to war, please. Cost me a lot of prestige, but... Worth it. Looks like he's actually made another friend. I'm at war with... No, just these people. Are those all his forces? It must be. Alright, well, let's try and get out of here immediately. That's not going well at all. Can we please leave? And actually, she has joined the war there. Let's get out immediately, please. Their army's going to come over and help us out. Very good. We lost a lot of our forces there. 330 while only killing 146. I didn't think it would go so terribly. I really didn't. We even lost one of our champions. Only one chariot died, though. He killed 32. The light footman did not do well at all. We'll go ahead and dismiss that. Let's uh, let's wait for all of our forces to get back together here. We could raise another champion. We'll go ahead and have him join the army, of course. A servant of honesty. I was shocked when I caught Prince Perseus trying to steal from the travel chest of the visiting Koretar Ekademos. He confessed he had thought he could get away with it. This is my son there. He's 11. We try and keep him honest. Deceitful or humble. Let's try and uh, keep him honest there. Very good. Let's merge up our army and let's try to defend our land. Now, where did they go? They might be coming after us, so let's go and defend our capital here. My ailing son Achilles is still suffering from consumption. And he's very delicate. That's not quite an Achilles, is it? It's time to decide how to treat his consumption. We'll go ahead with some drastic measures again. Disastrous treatment. It took me a moment to recognise him. He is so bruised and swollen, he barely looks human. As I grab his hand, my son attempts to br uh, speak, but no sound passes his lips. The leprous physician is standing in the corner of the room, anxiously wringing her hands. Guards put her under lock and key at once. Could blind her, but I want her money. That's what I want. I want all that money. Dismiss her as concubine, of course. We shall leave my court. No, we don't want that. Hi, can we not? Why can we not ransom her for all that money? I want all of that money. Give it to me. If we go to prisons here, is there anything I can do? No, just execute or release. I can't even ransom her. This is madness. This money should belong to me. Oh, well, we'll uh, leave that where it is. Hopefully these guys here can... Oh, they are under attack and losing. That's not good. That's not good at all. Uh, do I have to call in Athens as well over this province? I can do just that. Not as much prestige to call them in. We've now called in all of our friends. Not quite what I was going for. My son Achilles has recovered from his consumption. Very good. He's half a wounded, one-eyed and delicate. Our friends again destroyed. Athens has already lost their army. Knossos is 
not keeping a hold of their forces. This is not going good at all. Well, they have gone into fights here. I doubt it will make any difference. But we could try it. we will arrive there in seven days. I don't think it's going to be soon enough. We're all going to be dead by the time we arrive. Yes, they are. What a waste of time. We are going to get slaughtered. So slaughtered. This is terrible. Absolutely terrible. I'm trying to murder him, but that's not going to help us, is it? No, this was meant to go a lot easier. But my allies insist on attacking... Still, let's, let's say be it there. These guys, they can't be that strong, surely. They, they still have a thousand men there. But it is only one island itself. What a disaster. We have lost another 500 forces. My god, we're getting slaughtered. Uh, but let's go ahead and blame our allies here. They decided to run in without any aid and get themselves killed. Now our enemies are coming for us. Now number us three to one. I don't think there's anything here I can do at all. And there's a single thing we can do. We could try and besiege their capital. Let's see, are these forces going to follow me? Actually, three champions. Let's move them over here. Ten, ten men. Good. Well, we'll let them take our capital, and we'll start besiege on theirs. My friends don't appear to want to come and join, so we'll just uh, leave them over there to do absolutely nothing. No, they are coming down, but we will win this on time, I'm sure. When, when are you going to arrive here? One day to there. Actually, we have taken his capital. And we've captured his wife. We will not take a white piece, however. Let's... Let's go to sea. And let's sail back over to our capital region. Very good. A court of war, you say? Athens is under attack from somebody. Somebody stronger than them. Well, let's, uh, let's ignore that. There's only a minor penalty there. Yes, we're getting bamboozled again. This is not great. Because they are simply going to re-siege their land there. There's nothing I can do. Ah... Well, this has been a disastrous episode. It really has. Let's assign a new steward. And let's simply surrender. We're going to lose a lot of money here. 153 ducats, my god! And that's of all of these forces together. They just... The AI just decided it was a wiser idea to sail in and take them on one at a time. And because of that, we have really been destroyed here. It's it's a shame, but some wars are lost. I have to go ahead and surrender here. Putting us in debt for a very long time. Terrible, terrible. Prince Perseus seemed to enjoy our latest feast immensely. Of all the things, he could not stop talking about the rich clothes and glittering gold he saw there. These are the trappings of power which our world is ruled could show him how to make friends. Let's not gain the stress. We're already very, very stressful here. Now that was a terrible war. Let's not go through that again. Oh, good. I actually have a prisoner he will pay gold for. Well, that's going to help us a little bit. And then there's still you who I, for some reason, can't banish. Oh, I can banish right there. Oh, my bad. Well, let's take all of her money then. Excellent. Well, that would help us a fair bit. Wow, we got uh, we got bamboozled there, didn't we? How is my brother? He's still alive. Good for him. My son and heir is 13 now. Soon he'll be of age. Unrepresented, you say? A Cranoy man from Hermione has come to petition me for increased representation in my government. Control level in I gainer. I gainer, I gainer. I don't know where I gainer is. Damos of I gainer. Oh, is this the man? No. The county level in Damos of I gainer will go down, but I don't see any Damos of I gainer. But it would be my land person, wouldn't it? 
Damos of. Oh my Kenny, that's my capital. No, it's not. I gain. I gain. Yeah, yeah not sure what it is. So we could just loosen the reins and have this guy join our court. He can fight. Sure. Good man, welcome to the gang. Can't demand his conversion, however. Money, we won't be in debt for too long. We already do have a uh, claim to press over here. Shouldn't be too hard. He does have his friends, though. There's a lot of them in total. I was watching Achilles play with other children when Cuporio was trying to push him over. Achilles took it all in stride and sat down to talk to him instead. And become forgiving. He is already one-eyed and... Word in delicate. He's probably the sort of man we do want to be forgiving. So we'll go ahead and allow him to do just that. That'll do for this episode. It's been quite a failure of an episode. This war was very costly. And we lost it. This war, however, I don't think will be the same. We'll just simply sail over and siege out their one single province. I'll see you guys in the next one. Thank you again for watching. Goodbye.